Welcome back to Tennis Talk. My name's Cam Williams, and Rafa Nadal has confirmed that he will be playing in Cincinnati next week. His first hard court matches since Indian Wells at the start of the year, back in March, because he pulled out of Miami the week after due to those rib injuries. Let's go check over on Instagram the announcement of Rafa playing Cincy. So this is what Rafa said over on Instagram with a photo of him having a lovely time out in Spain, saying, very happy to play again in Cincy, flying there tomorrow. So with Rafa in the field, we have a strong list of players playing this event. Here are the top eight seeds for the event. Starting with the number eight seed, Hubi Hercatch, he will be playing. Felix Ojealiasim will come in as the seventh seed. Andre Rublev, he's the number six seed. Kasper Ruud will be the fifth seed. Cincy Pass is seeded fourth in Cincy next week. Alcaraz will come in at the number three seed. Raf is going to be at the number two seed. And of course, the world number one, Daniel Medvedev, will be playing as the number one seed. Zverev is withdrawn, so he won't be featured. And also Novak Djokovic, at this stage, won't be able to get into Cincinnati or into America, so he is not going to be featured at the event. So there you have it. It's a very strong lineup for Cincinnati. And of course, Rafa playing. That's a big, big deal. We haven't seen him for a long time on the hard courts. And also, how's he going to look? Because he's been injured a lot this year. Of course, pulled out of Wimbledon due to injury. He's taken a few weeks off. He pulled out of last week's Canadian Open as well. And he did win this tournament back in 2013. So he does have happy memories here of lifting this trophy. But let me know down in the comments below. How far can Rafa go at this event? We've seen a lot of those top guys, Medvedev, Alcaraz, City Pass, all dropping out of the Canadian Open this week in massive upsets. So Rafa's going to like his chances next week in Cincy. But again, let me know down in the comments below. How well do you think Rafa's going to go in his first hardcore matches back?